<laughs> well, forget about cooking. How about ordering a delicious pizza for dinner? We found just the spot. Oh, yeah, and Lori Wallace <laughs> doing us a favor by uh, coming live from Sacramento to show us their menu. Good morning, Lori. Hey. I am here for you. That's what I do, right? Okay, so it wasn't that long ago, guys, that we were at Lowbrow and we saw that amazing thing they did out front where they opened it all up and created this patio space. Well, now we're at Beast and Bounty. Uh, same owner, Michael Harkness. He had the same thing over here, but he created a pizza and wine patio. So this is a really different experience than what people are used to inside Beast and Bounty. It's a little more casual, but still, I'm going to say it, Michael, still bougie to me. I like it. <laughs> so let's talk bougie. about what you've done out here because it's beautiful. Yeah, so we've just uh, expanded our footprint into the street. We have 2,200 feet inside. We have about 4,000 feet out here. And we're doing kind of more of a casual concept, really. It's pizza and wine. It's natural wine, not the kind of stuffiness of regular wine, although we do have wine. But uh, yeah, it's just a fun expression of what we're doing. And the menu's a little bit different too, a little more approachable than, than maybe what people are used to at Beast and Bounty. I mean, pretty much straightforward. It's just pizzas, small bites, and some salads. So yeah. Okay, and we should mention for people at home watching, looking to get the whole family out of the house, maybe everyone needs a little break. This is a dog-friendly and kid-friendly patio, so it's really opened up uh, to a lot of different people too. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, we're we're welcoming all people, people that are just walking by, strolling through the neighborhood. It's it's catering to the neighbors that are here. We had three neighbors show up last night. So yeah, we're just kind of, everybody's welcome. So let's talk about what's gone into this because it certainly was a lot of work. You still are in the process of, of making it even bigger and better, but let's talk about kind of what went into to building this out. Well, you know, first off, my dad's a general contractor and so I got to give him props. Uh, he's uh, awesome. He built all of this. He built the furniture. He built this little shed back here. And um, yeah, so I mean, pretty much everything has been a labor of love. We built all the benches, the tables, Mike Wiston, a friend of mine, did all the metal work on the tables. Um, so yeah, uh, we're hanging all the bistro lights. We've still got more lanterns going in. We've got neon coming in. We've got other little fun elements that are going to be uh, showing up. And this is something that you wanted to do kind of anyway, is to expand out here and have this space open to customers. Yeah, I mean, I've been talking to our landlord about it for the last couple months. and. I think at first he wasn't sure what we really wanted to do, and then he saw what we did over at Lowbrow and saw how successful that was, and and so yeah, we've uh, we, we finally were able to do it. We actually got the street closure on Friday, and so we started building Monday, and we did all of this in four days. So we're all tired, haven't slept. <laughs> Not only uh, do you do it and do it very well, but you do it very fast. He gets these things up really quick. So last night you kicked it off. You had a great response. What are your hours, and when can people come check out the patio? Okay, so for the first week, we're going to be open from three to ten. Uh, show up, show up around three, um, and then maybe the following week we'll expand our hours into the evening time, and then we're going to be looking at doing brunch in the next couple of weeks as well. All right, I love it. Well, nice job. It's beautiful out here, guys. For folks looking to get out, maybe not cook dinner tonight, it's the perfect spot. I'll send it back to you. Oh, it's <laughs> lovely. Thanks, Lori. It's great out there. <laughs> she does this for us. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm.